Hello baseball card enthusiasts. So today we're going to be opening up a 1990 version of a Donner's wax box. Um, I believe this is the first year that they actually had a true seal on it, but then again, it really wouldn't be necessary for our purposes. I didn't think it would be necessary to buy any kind of certified box because this is kind of a hated set by a lot of people, so, um, but I kind of like it from the standpoint of I like the red cards and everything, and I think there's some um, pretty cool rookies out there. I mean, obviously the best rookie, a lot of good rookies, not really Hall of Fame rookies, but some good rookies nonetheless. My favorite would be uh, Sammy Sosa included in there. You have some good error cards with... Uh, Juan Gonzalez, where he's actually facing the wrong way, um, considering an error card. I mean, it's still not very expensive as far as trying to find it anywhere, but nonetheless, it's still an error card. Um, there's some other cool rookies in here. We have, let's see, let's go down the list here. We've got Sammy Sosa we talked about. Um, Larry Walker. Larry Walker's another good one. Some say that he may end up being a Hall of Famer at some point. Um, let's see who else we got. Bernie Williams, one of my favorites, um, just because he's a Yankee and he's in the um, has his number retired for the Yankees Hall of Fame. David Justice, always liked David Justice. Thought he was a he was pretty cool. You know, he actually was the one who had the one single run in the in the World Series game where they actually beat the Cleveland Indians for their only World Series title. Um, so yeah, I mean, I think there's some some good ones in here. I think we also have um, you know we have a King Griffin Jr. card in here. It's, it'll be his second year card. We have um, um, a few others that are not coming to mind, but we will get into it and see what we can find. Break the less important seal on this. Almost 30 year old wax box. Some people don't like the, you know, the combination of the red and kind of the orange of the packs. The packs seem like they're in pretty good shape. I don't know, never mind it. Maybe it's because I really need, I really never opened up a whole box of these. I didn't have a whole lot of experience with these because this was kind of at the tail end of my first round of collecting. So let's get going. Cargus Dremski is the puzzle for this one. See, some people just don't like the red. I guess they think it's just too much red. I don't know. I'm an Alabama fan, so I kind of like it. Eric Davis. I'm not sure if that is his rookie card. It could be. players there's a lot I don't because I was trying to getting toward the end of my collecting. Bo Jackson can never go wrong with a good Bo Jackson card. These cards feel really good. They're really tight. The corners are really sharp. So I'll set that one aside because I like that. Carlton Fisk, Hall of Famer.
Steve Sachs, Diamond King, Jerry Reed, not the actor and singer Jerry Reed. Some of these names are kind of hard to read since they're in cursive. Walt Weiss, Sammy Sosa. There we go, we're right off the bat. Sammy Sosa rookie card. That's a really good shape. Great centering. It's a nice card. So that breaks my streak of not getting the primary rookie card in the set. I'm having some problems with that with my break of 89, 88, and 87. I still got some good cards in there, but it seems like the key ones were eluding me. Craig Long, Terry Steinbach. I was a, kind of an A's fan back in the 80s because of Kinseko and McGuire. So I kind of got to know the A's a little better. Mike Greenwell. Big name back then. Steve Sachs. Fernando Valenzuela. The line of the shields, that's another good rookie card. Barry Larkin, Hall of Famer. Eddie Murray, Hall of Famer. It's a good pack. And Gary Sheffield. This is his second year card. Still a good card. Mike Stanton, part of the Braves, the Braves pitching staff in the 90s. Kyle Ripken. Mackie Sasser. Francisco Cabrera. Nolan. 5,000 Ks. That's a good insert. I like that. It's already like in this box already and it's not full of the Hall of Fame rookies like uh, promised in some of the other ones, or at least should be in the other ones. Back of that one. No one around Diamond Kings. Another Cal Ricken. It's kind of a variation. I don't know what we looked at. That one may have been an insert. We 
controller. Yeah, okay, next pack. Todd Stottlemyre, Kyle Ripken, Kirby Puckett, Mark Gardner, haven't heard of that one, Bernie Williams, that's his rookie card. Great player for the Yankees. Charlie Huff, who was about 115 years old. And that was when he was playing. I don't even know what my holdy is now. Military Steinbach. Dion James. Jake Bell. No names in this pack. Andrew Guerrero, Francisco Cabrero, Joe Strawberry, Strawberry save that pack. Not by much, but. Mark Lemke, second year car. Gary Sheffield, second year car. Barry Larkin, Hall of Famer. Carlton Fisk, Hall of Famer. Eric Anthony, rookie car. Fernando. back here. Lance McCullers, Deion Sanders, I believe that is his rookie card, yes. Bo Jackson, MVP card. Different way to look at that one. Von Hayes, rookie MVP card. The shields, another one for that. Just cursive uh, names are messing with me, and I'm not a millennial for them to be messing with. Greg Maddox, Kyle Ripken, Slipper Hagen, Nolan Ryan. Diamond Kings, 
Interesting. Don't normally have a flip in this set. Andy Bennis. That's a good rookie card. Another Dale Strawberry. George Bell. in the background over probably nothing. Somebody walking their dog. The inside thing wants to let everybody know about it. Five checklist, what everybody needs. Some people like collecting checklists. I'm not one of those. David Justice, that's his rookie card. Todd Zeal. Vince Coleman was a good player. Franco. Jose Canseco almost didn't recognize the car. And there's checklist, checklist number six. And I don't think we're halfway through the pack box yet. Making sure we know who's in these boxes. I'm sorry, that last one was a diamond key to check with. Make sure we know who that is. Old Can Boyd, one of the best names ever in baseball. King Griffey Sr. He's with the Reds. Mm -hmm. 
to Marines MVP. That's about our 14th Pete Smith card. Brian Dubois. I heard that name. Just have to put the wrong one down. list out of this they would be covered. Fred McGriff. Always liked him. The crime dog, Fred McGriff. The very first time I watched him play for the Braves. I want to say it was um, I believe it was the first time. There was a fire that they had up in the, they were still playing in Turner Field at that time. Had a fire up in the press box or something like that and he hit a home run and that was kind of helped with his, or Elmar, helped with his uh, nickname there. Craig Biggio. Bunch of Hall of Fame base cards out of this box. Another one. See how we're racking up on the Hall of Fame base cards here. to the cards just by coming apart like that. Better than that than the tops that stick the gum in there and then you have a nice so uh, long piece of gum print on the back of a card or something like that and in essence ruin the value of the card. You know, unless you didn't care about looking at the backs of things. And some of the earlier packs of tops would have the gum in there and it could be on the front. So you could actually have some major issues with it. You know, 30, 40 year old piece of gum. You know, tell what the thing's made of and Bart Giamatti insert card. Never seen that one before. Barry Bonds, nice. So new people in this pack here. Pack Combs. So I as many checklists as I do rookie cards. Puzzle pieces back there, let it stick to those. That would make more sense. I don't think there's that many people that. Bobby Bow, MVP car. That people here are just would be down and out if they had something wrong with one of their puzzle piece cards, especially on the back.
farther we get down in the box of this, the worse the thing is sticking. It's been packed down there for 30 years, so. Andre Dawson. Cards are still in good shape. They feel very crisp and brand new in essence. Too much about that. And our last stack. Another Sammy Sosa rookie card. Awesome. Two in this pack. Two in this box. Centered very well. thing we haven't really seen is a one Gonzalez card. That's interesting. Having one actually turned around like that in this set. Must have been a printing issue. No run. Yeah we haven't seen the one Gonzalez. Yet, or even his, his rookie card or his uh, rookie era card. Which isn't that big of a deal, it's just a, like in a reverse image. Where it looks like he's batting left handed instead of right handed, or the way around. That'd be on Sanders rookie card. Dave Winfield, Hall of Famer. Another Brian Dubois, Ricky Card. Don't know if that's coming across in the video, but I'm going to sign upstairs playing his guitar. Hear it faintly, but I don't know if the camera can pick that up or not. John Crook. Not much value to John Crook, but he 